We are sitting at uh, Antonio De Luca's uh, studio, who is the art director of Self Published Be Happy, and uh, all this performance is organized uh, with CO Berlin and Self Published Be Happy. They are uh, giving a workshop about book publication, and in the next room, I'm uh, at the same time I'm doing the the performance during uh, during this weekend. The Published BIP is a curatorial project around um, sub-published books, photo books. Um, we have a collection of nearly 2,000 publications that were sent to us and um, we have an online platform um, where we feature such publication that becomes part of the um, collection. And what we've been doing in the last year is what we call SPBH Live which are basically, um, we call it printing performances or generally performances. We invite artists to engage to an idea, a place and, um, and um, perform live, so produce work live and sometimes that work becomes a publication, uh, an instant publication that is done in the place at the time of the performance. I'm planning to, to create a, a performance which um, hopefully helped me to, to create a new section, a new, uh, a new uh, uh, chapter for my upcoming book project. The title of this book project is um, uh, The Epic Love Story of a Warrior and, and the entire idea deals with, um, with the image what we share about the 20th uh, century's history in Central Europe or in Europe and I would like to question a little bit and uh, talk about this image, what, what we have about our past. When CEO Berlin asked us to come and visit um, our space in Berlin, um, our studio, um, we decided to um, invite an artist to use our studio as a shooting studio, so to become a photographic studio. And um, we, um, were, we are a fan of uh, Peter's um, work and I really admire the work they've done in the form of a self-published book and Books to the Star. And um, I knew that um, Peter was working on a new ambitious project and um, so we decided to invite him to use our studio as a place where to take some of these images that will become um, um, or that will be featured inside the book. I would like to uh, involve mm -hmm. strangers mm -hmm. and it's a very important uh, input as well to, to work with strangers, not always you know, with family and friends because I wanted to, to break the walls of my box you know, and I wanted to go yes. further and, uh, yeah. and this is a perfect situation to, to uh, uh, leave my safe zone a little bit. Close. Maybe this represents her without, without this. A workshop that we've been regularly doing, um, Antonio and myself, is that um, it's basically over usually two days. Um, people come, photographers come in with a set of images um, that they consider into making a book. And throughout the weekend what we do, we help them look at possibilities um, uh, and how to transform such photograph into a publication. And um, it's more an exercise to um, energize um, one's uh, practice um, more than you know making the perfect book over the weekend, which clearly is not possible. Um, what we, we do, we just offer them ideas and then we show them that actually in a weekend you can make something. So actually if you do want to make a real publication, uh, it's possible, not over the weekend, but it's possible to do it in a short amount of time. Mm -hmm. 
One point is um And this is what I really love in, um, in this context, that uh, different people from different countries come here together and work together and, um, and create yeah. new objects, new photographs and uh, maybe a new book.